Now into GameStop. Did you see what happened with GameStop the other day? Um, you saw they've made a lot of different, um, appointed a lot of new people to the board, the C-level executives. Um, and yeah, so they've been doing a lot of that. They got a new CFO, new chief growth officer, um, new ch- uh, chief technology officer. They've gotten people from Amazon and Walmart and a lot of big companies. They've been trying to get people who have experience in tech because GameStop is trying to change from like a brick and mortar retailer to being a solely tech business. And now they just said that it's going to name that they named Ryan Cohen the chairman. So that's a pretty big deal. Um, they announced that co-founder of Chewy, Ryan Cohen, who's been on the board of of GameStop, is going to officially be the chairman. Um, and they said that this is expected to take place following the company's annual shareholder meeting on June 9th, 2021. This is a pretty big deal. Um, ever since he joined the company, the stock price has done extremely well. Uh, he invested in GameStop about a year ago. They've done extremely well since then, really just because of everything with Wall Street bets and the massive short squeeze we saw. But now they're trying to, you know, really turn around the company, turn it into a GameStop, uh, turn it into, a, let's say, an Amazon for gaming. And the only way they could do this is, is you know, really focus on the technology behind it. They're trying to do sort of what Chewy has done. Chewy is an Amazon, but for pet supplies and pet products. So that's what GameStop is trying to do as well, be an Amazon, but for gaming. So I think having having Cohen, Ryan Cohen be higher up in the you know, have a more important position, more prominent position probably will help with that. I agree with them, you know, they've appointed him now to chairman. They have um a new CFO, new chief growth officer, new chief merchan- merchandising officer, and a lot of other major positions they've they've filled now with people who have a lot of experience in the technology space. I think Great move on their part. Something that we'll want to keep an eye out on moving forward. How it's because it's not an easy task. It's not going to be easy transitioning from like selling g- games and discs like the hardware to now going into a digital, maybe software sort of business. It's not going to be easy, but with the people they have leading the company now, definitely more likely that they'll succeed than they would have before. Definitely more more likely.